just to be just just to be close to you you see satan is trying to stop my hands from staying up in america with all these attacks but what america don't understand and i'm talking to all of you on youtube and all social media saying all this foolishness what you don't understand is that you're going to lose against russia without my hands being up over this country and i say that with boldness because i know i've been sent to help you And some of them, they're just faggots. It's a devil behind them. That's who I'm after. I want his neck. He says, shall I hide from Abraham, Abraham the thing that I'm about to do to Sodom and Gomorrah? He said, no, I'm going to go down and commune with him and let him know whatever. And then Abraham says, well, if there be 10 in the city, or first start off with 25, will you spare the city? He said, okay, I'll do it. Then Abraham said, well, wait, 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 wait. It may not be 25 in there because there's so many faggots. <laughs> That's right, Larry Reed. You're a faggot. There are so many faggots in Sodom and Gomorrah. Maybe 15 people. Yeah, you know that faggot Larry Reed. He's, he's always airing trying to take stuff I say take this Eric clip it out tell them I said you are a faggot cause you are and Larry Reed is a flaming homosexual you darn transvestite I'm not like these other punk pastors you can get on your little stupid stuff and say something about it. You're an idiot. <laughs> Negro, please. Get out of here. Some people, I can hear their thoughts out there already. Why is he exposing Larry Reed? Larry Reed needs to be exposed. Amen. Let me tell you why. Because number one, I mean, I don't know what man speaks like that. That faggot sound in his voice. You sound like a darn woman. You need to repent. Number two, he's always putting down men and exalting women. Y'all know I love both genders. The point is, I noticed that faggots have a girl spirit in them. I'll say it again. Faggots. That's right, I called you a faggot. Have a girl spirit. They have that woman in their spirit. They have that. You know, even for you to move your hands like you do. What man flip his hands like that? Unless you got sugar in your tank. You could tell those who got it because it's in their wrists, it's in their waist. No real man walk like that or talk like that. You, God did not put you as a police in the body of Christ. Especially a faggot. You don't have no authority. You ain't even a real man. God give real man dominion over the earth. Not faggots. I've heard him and he is funny. No, I don't mean that funny. Not laughing funny. He's funny gay. That ain't funny to me. He's gay. It's sickening to me. Every time I hear that voice from him, it's sickening. It's evil. He has nothing better to do but to talk about other men of God. God is going to get you. If you don't repent, you have a season and a time and a times and a half before the Lord visits you. He's going to shut you down. He's going to shut everything you do down. And I'm not only talking to Larry Reed, I'm talking to Christian Post. I'm talking to every newspaper outlet. I want him to hear me. Because I know they watch everything I, I do. And this is on live stream, right y'all? Good, that's what we want. I want the whole world to hear it. Stop following that faggot. 
Abraham said, you know what? Abraham said, you know what? I know Lot is saved, but I know that's a booty bandit city. Both of those cities, Sodom and Gomorrah, they're faggots. Then Abraham, Abraham starts saying, you know what? <laughs> they're beyond faggots. And you can see they were beyond faggots because when angels went down there, they were trying to hump on the angels' booty. And the angels have to strike them with blindness. Because no angels ain't putting up with that. They're real ones. That's right. That's right. Why don't you faggots try to try an angel? They'll strike you with blindness. I'm not against the gay community. The gay, gay people, we just saw a gay young man got delivered up here with this crusade. Th this isn't hate speech. I love everybody, including people who are bound by homosexuality. But what I do refuse is for you to try to make it like it's normal. It's a spirit. It's from another kingdom. I am against it. God is against it. And you need to repent. Now I heard that Atlanta has almost become a Sodom and Gomorrah. It, it's so much homosexuality in, in Atlanta, also in San Francisco. Oh, brother, you shouldn't talk like this. I'm going to keep talking like this. I'm going to get your freaking attention. Just to be close to you. It's my desire